him to use you, he'll use you. You know, I thank God because when I was coming up and being raised up in the church, you see a lot of different things, you know, that's going on. You don't know what's real. You don't know what's fake nowadays, you know. But I thank God because if we keep putting our children the true meaning of serving God, if we're coming from the Bible and we're feeding it to them, when they go out, it'll be in them. I used to blame myself for the things that my kids did that I knew that wasn't right, wasn't pleasing to God. I used to tear myself apart trying to find out where did I go wrong. God had to let me know as long as I taught them right. When they got old enough and responsible for their own sins, it's no longer on me.
young to witness. You're not too young to talk to people about God. Right, talk to your friends. You can be a drawer. Don't be a follower right. unless you're following Christ. All right. Unless you're following Christ. Awesome. You don't have to do what everybody else is doing. Hallelujah. You don't have to do it. It's not worth the repercussions that you will get. Because if you're doing good, you're going to benefit from it. If you're doing bad, you're going to benefit from that. Right. But you want the good to be a reward and not the bad to be destruction. Right. To end your life. Oh. Don't do it. It's easy. It's, it's easy to live for Christ if you want to. Uh -huh. It's a want thing. You got to want it. Right. You got to want to be right. Uh -oh. You got to want to live holy. Yeah. You got to want to see his face again. Yeah. If you want it bad enough, then you will do it. The same way you wanted it bad enough to lie about it, want it bad enough to tell the truth. I know that's right. Want it bad enough to tell the truth. Let God lead you. Let him show you. He can do it. You know you desire to be a teacher, a doctor, a football player. You still got to seek God. It's not going to happen unless you seek God. You got to seek him and do what it takes. That means living right. That means fasting. That means praying. So the same way y'all do when we go on the fast, y'all want to fast too? Fast for it. You got to fast. When it say seek ye first the kingdom, that's exactly what it means. You got to seek him. Seek him. You go to do the knocking. You start the knocking and say, God, here am I. God, here am I. God, here am I. Get in a place. Get in a place. And talk to him just the way you come to us and talk to us. Talk to God the same yes, way. Sir, right Talk to God the same way. You ain't got to do no all outlandish prayer. Yes, say yes, these big words. Yes, yes, you don't yes, have to because it's not your right. race to. That's right. When you get there, you'll be able to do that. But right now, talk to him like you're talking to Cabrini and Cabrini. Talk to him like y'all have y'all conversations oh. together. That's the way you talk to God. Yes, he hears you. Yes, yes, yes. If you sin, ask him for forgiveness because yes, you know yes. what a sin is. All right. Ask for forgiveness. Regardless of whatever the problem may be, even if you think you're going to get in trouble, confess it. Confess it to God and tell him. And I promise you, he'll give you a way to either go to your parents and talk about it. He'll do it. He'll do it. Or you'll go to him and talk about it and say, I did wrong. Can you forgive me? Do it. Talk to him. You younger adults, it's time. It's time to shake the dust off your feet. Uh -huh. Get busy. Uh -huh. And don't run too fast when you'll miss God. Uh -huh. But run just fast enough yes, yes, yes. that you can see. Yes. That's it. That you can yes. see him and you can hear him. Right. Don't turn your ear to God. He's talking to you daily. All right. Woo, he's talking to you oh, daily. Yeah. Uh -huh. He knows what you're going through. Oh. But you got to give it to him. I had to learn a long, just recently. When you give it to him, Please don't pick that back up. Yes, yes, yes. Leave that thing there. Yes, Even if something comes along and it looks like it's that same thing, you better call the devil a lie because he is a liar. You look it straight in his face and say, no, That's you're right. a liar. Right. And mean what you're saying. Right. Because if you see that you're a little weary, he will come in and make you believe what he wants you to believe. Right. He works here, not here. Talk to him. God knows your heart when your heart is pure. So right. purify that thing. Yes, yes, Get it right. Yes. Get it right with God. Get it right with your mama. Lord, get it right. Get that bond. Get that connection. My God. Do that. It's for you. You you have a dance out of this world. My God. He can use that dance yes. if you allow him to use the dance. Yes. Young people, it's time. Yes. It's time. We made time to do everything else. Go shopping. Go to the malls. Hang out with our friends. Let's put some of that time aside. Try it. All I'm asking you to do is try it. Try it. Just, just try it. Uh -huh. Just, just try it. Try it for a week. Those things that you would normally do, go out to eat, hang out with your friends, take that time and give it to God. And those things that you are desiring in your heart that are good for you, watch God move on your behalf. He will do it. Trust me. Get into the waiting period. Don't jump before him. Don't go and try to fix it yourself. Just stand still and wait. In your waiting, start praising him for that you are asking him for. And watch him open up the floodgates of heaven, pull you out those blessings like you've never seen before. You won't understand it. 
you somewhere, somewhere in Christ.